Okay, so you sent me a video, but it wasn't very long, so I just found more stuff on YouTube about this horse. So I'm going to go with this video because it's much longer for me to go through. So you'll see. With the front legs, he's just kind of winging out. So let me see if I can go back. And it's doing more of like a saddle gait here. So it's a lateral gait. It doesn't have a lot of overreach to it, but it looked like it was smooth, but it does wing its front legs out. At least it doesn't look like it's spooked at all and the horse ponies well. He is breathing hard a fair amount. So he probably was run around first. But at least it's not spooky. So all that's great desensitizing that they did. Very shooting a gun. But it's not a super loud gun, but it's still helpful to see that the horse is fine with all of those things. So here again, it's a smooth gait, but it's a saddle gait that they're doing. And the horse just kind of wings its front legs out. But that's okay. Some, some horses toe out, and so... They'll have more of that showy action. It's just something you want to be aware of. It looks like it does a little bit of ringing in the back end, uh, more of the left hind when I saw it in a different video, which I'll go back to. But it looks like the horse has really good training. Looks like but they put their time into them. And it's great that there's another loose horse in there. So you see this horse doesn't care. And of course, he doesn't have reins, a saddle, or anything. So you know they've put time in training. It's a little hard to tell from the angle. And a lot of Tennessee walking horses stand wonky. So sometimes it's not always true. The left leg looks pretty straight. But the right one looks like it's turned out. And I just want to see a better picture. If you're doing endurance, you might be interested in how the leg comes into the foot to make sure it's coming in straight. So here as it's coming down the hill, it looks like it might have just a little issue with its stifle on that left side. So it's having a little issue coming down with that leg and then it kind of twists some as it's going down that hill. So I'm being really picky here as it comes over these rocks here. You're going to see it, it kind of rolls its hip on this left side to get over those obstacles. But again, that might just be a weakness in that stifle, which a lot of horses are weak in the stifles in the beginning. So it's just something to be aware of. But it otherwise goes up and down the hill well. It looks like it's sure-footed. So here, just as it's going down, you'll see the left hind leg doesn't come up as far, and it's kind of twisting and turning a little bit. But they do a great job showing the horse. They were getting on and off of it. Here you'll kind of see as it's coming towards us, that right front leg turns out. Again, I don't mind that so much. Some people do. It's just something to be aware of. And some of these horses never have any issues with their legs. But he just toes out more on the right than he does on the left in the front. These guys seem very entertaining, the whole family. Everything <laughs> they're all doing. So I think the horse is probably really well desensitized because they're doing some crazy stuff with it and it doesn't seem to mind very much, which is good. So they did a good job. Here he is with cows. He's going downhill, so his gait's a little bit, you know, more lateral, uh, but he's not pacing. So here he's, he's just a little bit more step pacey. But the little girl's doing a pretty good job. So... If he was slower, I think he would be smoother. So I think he's just gone past his speed and she's just, you know, not helping him enough to be smooth. But at least little kids can ride him. All sorts of crazy stuff going on here. Well, and at least they're showing you really tr good trail stuff here. You know, they're not doing all the tricks and things that a lot of online sellers do. So it does look like they are do a really good job training their horses. So here they're doing a horse show and it looks like they're all going more towards like a racking gait. You'll see the kid in the red is bouncing. So he's more pacing, 
but he's doing pretty well here. You can see he's riding him with more collection than that little girl was, and so he's getting a better gait out of that horse. And so you can see that tail bouncing up and down. That's how you know they're doing a saddle gait or going towards a rack. So not a running walk, but a very smooth gait. I love that somebody finally put a bike in a video. So these are good trainers here. So this horse doesn't have a lot of overreach. You know, he just kind of has a, that shorter stride, but he looks very smooth. He has a a nice canter here and he's cantering on the correct lead in the front and the back on that left lead and this is good too he's cross tied here you know in a small space doesn't look like he's panicked or anything so you've seen him tied up and cross tied and the crazy kid there and the crazy dog and, uh, if you watch videos you see a lot of people pulling stuff and the horses are doing it but they're kind of scared and freaked out and this horse doesn't care at all that he's pulling that around so here he's doing more of that slow rack or saddle gait. And again, you see he doesn't care much about the flag. I love this. This is hysterical. These people do a really good job. So again, doing a little saddle gait here. The horses with the shorter strides like this, you know, are better at that steeper terrain. They're usually less trippy because they're not covering as much terrain, but they might not be as fast as the ones with the longer strides because they're not covering as much ground. So it just kind of depends on what kind of terrain you're doing. You can kind of see that right front toe out a little bit again, but he doesn't look like he's interfering. And it's nice. You see how they're all riding with that shorter rein and they all have some collection. And so you see here, he's getting some speed. You see that little jiggle in the saddle and the tail bopping up and down. So, you know, he's doing a saddle gait. And, you know, to some people, it look like a pace because it's so fast, but it's not. So, all a good job. So, overall, it appears to be a very nicely trained horse. I think this family, it does a great job with their training. And they expose the horse to a lot. You can tell they took time and did many different things with them. Uh, again, there's a couple things with the horse's confirmation. But, overall, it looks like... It's calm, it has a good attitude, it gates well, so then you just have to decide if it would work for you or not.